Welcome to the March 14th, 2024 uh, Masters of Pirate Party member meeting. Um, I'll identify as James O'Keefe Somerville. Steve Revelack, Arlington, Massachusetts. Joseph from Lowell. Excellent. <clears throat> so um, our the big thing is our election is over. Um, the list, the results are posted in the meeting agenda. Um, I've been slammed with work and haven't sent out an email, but that'll go out because there's a bunch of things to, uh, to start mentioning. Um, <clears throat> And then the only the only contested election was Elijah and Joe were tied for representative uh, to the U.S. Pirate Party. Um, but Joe, you said you would be willing to be the secondary in that role, and Elijah could take over as uh, as as the primary representative. And Joe indicates to me <laughs> over a different channel. I okay, <laughs> excellent. Um, okay, with that. Um, fine. Yeah, here we go. Um, so, in regards to that, um, uh, Melanie Campbell has been given signature power of the bank account um and um <clears throat> and uh so joe is off of that responsibility the website should be updated but i will double check that and um i have this thought joe that i mean as steve that um it would probably be good to have a third person uh have signature authority uh, would you be willing to do that, Steve, as secretary? Sure. Yeah, you don't have to, you know, keep track of the books or anything, but just, you know, in, yep. in case there's some problem, you know, um, it's not just uh, one person, just not just two people. So if two of the uh, two of the three are on a plane, <laughs> and I'm not. <laughs> sure. Speaking of planes, uh, so I don't have I don't have any other reports to give. Um, but speaking of planes, uh, the United States Pirate Party's National Conference is June 1st and June 2nd. Uh, lo it looks like, as far as I can tell, it's at the Best Western um, just outside of O'Hare Airport in Illinois. Um, and there's some details I've linked there to their blog post at the U.S. Pirate Party. Um, I will. Uh, I I reached out to them to see if they need a um, sign up form set up in their um, website, which I seem to help with. Um, and uh, yeah, any any other issues that you know of, Joe? Before you formally hand over to. Uh, Hand over. Hearing none. Okay, so uh, planning for 2024. Thank you, Joe. No issues. I, I received through another secure channel. Excellent. Secure channels are highly recommended. Um, and uh, so, yes, yeah, St Steve got the cities and towns. I need to start sending out email to uh, those folks and um, start getting our list of voters. Um, we've mailed voter, we've mailed members about um, being candidates. Um, oh, okay. So Joe clarifies just as an aside that they're working on location for the conference, but the best Western is where they're encouraging folks to stay. So, uh, in terms of the National Party Conference. 
And then, um, so yeah, I'll reach out to, we've got a bunch of emails to write this weekend. So I'll uh, reach out to people who have said they want to be candidates and remind them what the deadlines are. Um, speaking of deadlines, did anyone hear what happened with TikTok? Uh, so TikTok, uh, well, the U.S. House of Represent Representatives voted quite overwhelmingly. I think it was 300 something to 50 something, um, amazingly, um, to force ByteDance, which is a Chinese company, to sell TikTok to an American company which I thought was interesting, not even like, well, sell it to, you know, a German company or something. It was like, no, no, sell it to an American company. Um, I'm sure that'll go over really well. <laughs> and, um, uh, and, and so, yes, you know, it is not too late to run as a candidate for federal elections. Um, <laughs> if you want to get on the ballot, it is possible. Um, four of our Massachusetts representatives voted uh, against it. Um, in oh, where is it? Uh, let's see. It was McGovern Neal, which I was really surprised at. Um, well, uh, Presley definitely, and I think Clark. Yeah, I think it was Clark. Uh, Trahan, uh, 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 I'm not sure how to pronounce his name. Auchinloss, um, Lynch, um, and two of the others uh, uh, voted uh, for it. So, you know, there's your targets. If you want to go, in, <laughs> not in any negative way, if you want to run against them, in an election this November, uh, this the first Tuesday after the first Monday, um, then by all means, please uh, consider it. Wait, Steve Mnuchin so, is thinking about buying TikTok? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> I mean, I thought it was interesting that Biden was like, I'll sign that. I mean, I guess maybe he feels it won't get through the Senate. The rumor that I heard was that the Senate is not eager to, or the Senate leadership is not eager to take it up, mm -hmm. uh, which is encouraging. Um, uh, and then um, I think we're at least 50-50 in terms of uh, uh, what's going to happen with our Massachusetts representatives. Um, I know one is definitely against it. And um, so, yeah, I guess that'll be our topic on pirate news this Sunday. Well, it sounds like it sounds like it'll be a fun conversation. <laughs> I went back. We last discussed this 11 months ago, interestingly enough. Uh, also with the suit about... Um, uh the internet archive but the other thing was like trump is like flip-flopped right he's he was mm -hmm. like oh no it shouldn't be it shouldn't be this chinese company and like some billionaire talked to him who's an investor in in TikTok and was like in fight dance and was like oh no no you really need to change this tune, change this tune. <laughs> i'm wondering if that billionaire promised him money <laughs> Man. <laughs> All right. So, uh, so yeah, I mean the, the, yeah, Sunday for, uh, yeah, not March 3rd. Man, I got to update these things uh, sooner. So that would be the 15th, the 17th would be uh, the next Pirate News. Uh, I can make it, Steve. You can make it. Um, Joe. Well, you'll make it if you can. I uh, hope you can. And so if you want to join us, pontificate, um, not quite uh, talk, maybe talk radio, not quite um, 
uh, Sunday morning uh, major network uh, style, we're not meet the press after all, then, um, you know, you're welcome to come by and uh, join us for, if you want to help produce it. That's always good, too. Um, so Joe says that he will be there. Excellent. And then uh, we do have a candidate coming up who is not yet announced, but not this weekend, but the following at least two weekends, uh, we're going to go door to door and get signatures for said candidate. So if that's something you'd be interested in, send us an email at info at masspirates.org and uh, we'll tell you when and where. And we'll be announcing that soon, I hope. Uh, anything else for the agenda? Hearing none. Anything for the next for next the next agenda in two weeks? Uh, and and then. Uh, Steve, should we discuss on the democracy list when the next meeting there is? Uh, that sounds good. Okay. Um, and then uh, the National has been meeting Wednesday nights occasionally at 9 p.m. Um, so that's something that if folks want to jump on that on the Mass Pirates, on the, uh, you, sorry, the U.S. Pirate Party, excuse me, the U.S. Pirate Party tech meeting is generally Wednesdays at 9. Um, and if you want to help out, you can join the Discord, um, which is at uspirates.org and I think somewhere on our website. If not, I will make sure that's there. Uh, so with that, seeing there's nothing else to discuss, uh, all in favor of adjourning? Aye. Mm -mm. Aye. I, I get an eye through the, the side channel. Okay, excellent. Thanks, Joe. <laughs> With that, uh, we are adjourned. Thank you very much for watching this. I will upload this probably Friday, um, more than likely. And um, with that, uh, do check us out at Pirate News. I'm sure it'll be entertaining. I hope so. All right. Uh, I shall stop the recording. A short and sweet meeting. Uh, hope you all take. Hope you all uh, have a wonderful weekend. Uh, stay out of the rain. Bye.